Barcelona knows how to party. From cozy, dark, ancient watering holes with house-made vermouth to crazy Euro-trash mirrored ceiling nightclubs full of backpackers fresh out of their first year of college. You can find a place to get loose in this town easy. Just walking through the streets, you're bound to come across some form of a party where music and booze collide in a beautiful explosion. From elegant palaces where you can lounge in gaudy furniture and classical music to the zoo that is Club Sauvage that can be heard all the way down Paseo de Bourne. This town has you covered. That said, nothing will prepare you for Monday nights in Barcelona. Yeah, 4 a.m. in the morning on a Monday. Well, technically it's Tuesday. Right, Tuesday. Anyway, Nasty Mondays is an institution here in Barcelona. A giant, all-access, all-welcome party that is housed in this ancient Apollo nightclub. This celebration of all that is debaucherous is probably the most fun we had anywhere. Levels and levels of dance floors are packed with people from all over, all rocking to whatever the DJ decides to spin. Oh yeah, that's the DJ. Yeah, I mean, come on. Am I right? This place is crazy. This place is a beautiful mess. No one cares who you are, or where you're from, or what you do. As long as you love me. I don't know if you meant to put that in there, but it's very funny. All anyone cares about is having a good time, celebrating, and dancing. And the club is on board with that. They have a giant stage with a bar on top that, get this, just makes drinks and pours it down everyone's throat that's standing at the front. Yeah, you just stand up there and wait, and you receive your party booze. I mean, who does that? Yeah, that's Rob. Oh, and there he is again. Oh, and one more time. Yeah, that's that's me drinking out of a gas cast or whatever. What I'm saying here is that Dirty Mondays is a giant party where you can dance your ass off until you're numb and no longer can walk. And did we mention this was a Monday night? <laughs> uh, we'll let you go ahead and imagine what a Friday might be like.